We're warming up into the weekend. It's meteorologist Joe Martucci. Good to be with you here. And this weekend isn't going to be like last weekend where we were out on the beach carving pumpkins, but still a very comfortable one here and warmer than where we have been over the past couple of days. And it's all thanks to that big blue age. That's an area of high pressure. And where you see those white lines, those are lines of equal air pressure. We call them isobars. And since high pressure is spinning clockwise, you kind of can draw a line around that H, and that means southwesterly winds as we go into the day on Friday, and that will help warm us up. Good amount of sunshine during our Friday here. Some clouds will build in Friday night, and Saturday does look to be fairly cloudy. It's probably a lot of high, thin clouds. We call it filtered sunshine, milky sunshine. It's not going to be a gloomy gray day here, but the clouds will continue as we go into Saturday night. As an area of low pressure moves from the Great Lakes offshore, the rain will stay offshore, though, as we go into our Sunday, and we'll have another dry weekend day. Take a look at your Friday morning numbers. We go from the mid-30s at 7 a.m. up to the, around 50 by 10 a.m., so a good jump in temps there. Bunch of clear sky to go around, and we'll stay bright and blue as we go into Friday. It's a more seasonable day with high temperatures around 60 degrees. Then, as we take a look at your weekend here, looking really nice for Saturday and Sunday whether you want to go for a run, you want to hang out on the boardwalk, you got a house project to tackle, maybe raking leaves, everything is looking really nice. Temperatures a little bit milder Sunday as opposed to Saturday, but all of this still seasonable. And our nights, not as chilly as what we saw over the past couple of nights across South Jersey as well. If you do want to do some leaf peeping this weekend, well, we're getting close to peak here. In fact, we're peak pretty much west of the Garden State Parkway. And then we have high color along the parkway itself, that parkway corridor, and then lesser color as you head over towards the shore and down to lower Cape May County. But look for our foliage to really blossom over the weekend here. If you're going up to the northwest corner of the state, even towards Trenton, where you see those dark colors, that means past peak colors. So certainly fall is definitely taking its course here with the chilly air that we've had over the past couple of days. And then our weekend, which will be fairly seasonable. So we take a look at your inland seven-day forecast. Temperatures will climb slowly as we go into the weekend. Peaking on Monday and Tuesday. Monday, definitely the better of the two days to do something outside. Good amount of sunshine. Election day, we'll have some showers in our forecast here. I don't believe it's going to be a washout, though. Same story for Wednesday. Some showers, not a huge deal for us. And then a cool down as we go into the later part of next week.